Welcome back to Game Raiders Play. This is part 21 of Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. Now in the last video I said it was part 19. I meant part 20. A, big, a bit of a mix up on my part. However, if you enjoy this video, please give it a like and subscribe. And let's see how we do on this one. We're going to continue the story as Vegeta. Here we go. You a local on this rock? I got a business proposition for you. Give me what you got, and I might not kill you. Who the hell are you? Remnants of Frieza's pitiful army? Are you... Vegeta? W what are you doing here? Oh, I get it. With the Frieza Force gone, you've become a galactic highwayman too. Sorry, but I got here first, and I ain't sharing with you. You caught me in a bad mood. That will be your final mistake! Die! Should be worth eating. Well, <laughs> this'll do. I'd better eat 
something. I got what you asked for. That better be all of it. Now that I have this, the room's as good as ready. Wait here. All right, it's finished. Kakarot trained under 100 times gravity. So I'll have to triple that and train under 300 times gravity. Actually, I wouldn't do that if I were you. Assuming you weigh, say, about 175 or so pounds, that'd be approximately 18 tons of pressure. That's only three times what Kakarot did. There's no way I can't handle it. That Vegeta is unbelievable. Training under 300 times gravity? Is he trying to kill himself? Uh, Vegeta, what are you doing? Shut up, woman. Leave me be. Oh, you don't want my help? Suit yourself. Why? Why can't I reach his level? I... I am the Prince of the Saiyans. Sheesh. There's just no getting through to you, is there? You're insane! Have you been at it this whole time? <laughs> You're not going to make any progress if you keep this up. <laughs> Why don't you just ask Goku what he does to turn into a Super Saiyan? I'd die before I ask for that low-class loser's help! Yeah, then why don't you try dying? What did you say? I've prepared a special training partner for you in the simulator. Think you can beat them? Do you have any idea who you're talking to, you ridiculous woman? You're Vegeta, the almighty Saiyan Prince, right? 
<laughs> I guess that settles it then. Good luck. And one more thing. My name's Bulma, not woman. Think you can remember that? Do you know who you're talking to? D damn that woman! This place, this is the wasteland where I first fought Kakarot, which means... But how? I'm fighting myself? What the hell? <laughs> Consider yourself lucky. A super elite like myself, wasting his time playing with scum like you. Damn that blasted woman! What the hell is her problem? You're not alone. I will surpass even myself. I will punish myself for lagging behind Kakarot. Wow, I guess that wasn't enough of a challenge for you, huh? You, you really know how to piss me off. Oh, come on. I was just messing around with you. More. Huh? You're right, it wasn't enough. You're going to make me a stronger opponent. 
Don't you take that tone with me! I'm going to get stronger and use that strength to crush those androids! You have a problem with that, Bulma? Fine. You're a real pain, you know that? Wait. He just called me Bulma for the first time, didn't he? Kakarot, I will surpass you. Just wait. You'll realize that I'm number one. Hey, Chi Chi! We're back! Hi, Mom! Man! We really worked up a sweat today! Goku, do you have a second? Sure, Chi Chi, but can it wait? I'm starving! Don't you? I'm starving me! I got a bone to pick with you! What? <laughs> Why can't you act more like our neighbors and drive us to the store once in a while? But, Chi-Chi, we don't have a car. And even if we did, I couldn't drive it. I don't have a license. You need to get a driver's license! You're the only one around here who still doesn't have something that basic! Piccolo doesn't have one either. What use would I have for that? Then you need to go to driver's ed. Think of it as training to become normal, everyday people. You're both obsessed with training, right? Then you can't say no. What? What do I have to? The next day, after catching an earful from Chi-Chi, Goku and Piccolo reluctantly made for town to enroll in driving school. Now then, shall we begin the driving lesson? <laughs> if this is how it's gonna be, then I'm all in. Listen up, Goku. Whether it's in battle or on the road, I'm not losing to you. All right, I get you. This is a different type of training. It's on, Piccolo! Um, there's no need to view this as a competition. Are you all right? Do this. Remember, safety first, okay? This isn't putting safety first! Woohoo! No, 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 no! I bet this thing can go even faster. Uh, don't forget about safety! We should be able to make it, right? I bet this thing can go even faster. Woohoo! No, 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 no! We should be able to make it, right? I bet this thing can go even faster. 
No, 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 no! Man, this feels great! Time, Goku. W wait! I said wait! A license isn't some prize for bragging rights. It's to ensure that you can drive safely and responsibly. Like I care about that. I will not accept defeat from the likes of him. <laughs> I think I'm starting to get a hang of this whole driving thing, don't you? Let's go, Piccolo. Come on, let's do this thing. Uh, excuse me! With pleasure. It's on, Goku! Oh yeah, Piccolo? Hey, Chi Chi, we're back! Goku, so how'd it go? <laughs> Handled it like a complete pro. I beat Piccolo no problem. <laughs> you what? I'm not exactly sure what you mean by that, but whatever. Did you get your license? Oh, actually, there's probably something you should know. I think the instructor was a little freaked out by how we drove. She told us she'd give us our licenses if we promised to never come back. <laughs> so... so you... you didn't actually pass the test? Well, at least you got your license. Yep. Now we can buy a car and finally go on those family drives I've been dreaming about. Well, the thing is, they also said we'd have to pay for all the damages caused during the test, and I can't even guess how much that'd be. What? Uh, I'm not so good with money, so... I'll let you handle that. Thanks, Gigi. Y you Well, now that that's done, let's get back to training. Mom? Whoa, Chi Chi! You all right? I know it wasn't easy, but you finally got your license, Goku. I'm proud of you. Now all we need is a car. A car? Do we even have money for that kind of purchase? Well, 
Not after paying back the city for all of the damages you caused when you were taking the test to get your driver's license. I'm counting on you to get us that car, Goku. Oh, right. I see. Sorry about that. Hey, uh, why don't... Why don't I ask Bulma? She's a whiz with machines. Cars are machines. Good idea. Bulma always has a solution up her sleeve. That's true. I guess I'll hit her up about it then. You do that. Oh, hey, Goku. What brings you here? Well, it's not a big deal, but I was hoping you could help me with a little problem. Uh, sure. What's up? Not sure if you heard, but Chi-Chi made me get a driver's license, which is fine, but the thing is, now she wants a car. Got an extra one lying around in those tiny capsules? <laughs> Doesn't that beat all? Earth's champion, now a licensed driver. <laughs> sure, I can get you a car. Seriously? You don't strike me as a responsible driver. Any normal car would turn to scrap with you behind the wheel. Find me the stuff I need, and I'll hook you up with an extra sturdy set of wheels. All right, then. So what do you think we need? It's all on this list. Be sure to refer to it when you're out scavenging so you don't forget anything. Oh, and one more thing. Leave all matters of maintenance and upgrades to me. Excellent. Thanks a lot, Bulma. Don't mention it. After all, happy wife, happy life. I'm home, Chi-Chi! Well, did you get us a car? After I round up a bunch of materials, Bulma's gonna make one for us. Really? That's wonderful, Goku! Then you'd better get to finding those materials. I'm sure it'll be good training, too. I don't know if I'd go that far, but then again, you never know till you try. All right. What should I do today? Dad! Mom's calling for you! Really? Uh, okay. Hey, Piccolo, do you think you could take Gohan and train him for a while? At least until I can catch up. <laughs> Fine. Goku, I just got a call from Master Roshi. He said launch is back at Kame House. 
Oh, yeah? Talk about a blast from the past! So what's going on with her? I'm not sure, but he said she wanted to talk to you about something. But I've got training to do. Don't you dare be disrespectful to Master Roshi! Just head over there and hear them out! Oh... Yeah, you're right. Guess I'll make my way over there. Be careful! Well, better get going, I guess.